All right. Um, Denver and Rio Grande Railroad versus Pedersen. Uh, this case, I've already basically talked about the um, effect of it. I'm just going to reassess the rule once again, is that um, wealth does not affect your duty to care. Railroads do not owe you a greater duty to care than random drivers of cars. That's not to say they don't owe you a duty of care, but that duty of care does not increase if they have more money, right? You can say that a duty of care increases as the cost to prevent the accident goes down. There is arguments that, will, that can reasonably be made for that, but you can't argue that if, as someone's resources go up, they owe a greater duty of care. That's all that case has to say.